hello guys in this video we'll see how the energy and power related to periodic and non periodic sequences if energy is infinite then we can say the given sequence is periodic if it is non periodic then power is infinite we will write the code for that first write the matlab basic commands to close all the commands of matlab or all the windows of matlab then declare the input sequence and give input to select particular sequence whether it is periodic or non periodic so declare the length of the y then declare time period for discrete signal then give energy from law energy equal to then write the condition if else statement we'll use here now write the condition for power if it is non periodic then it will go for energy energy equal to norm of y whole square now uh, if it is power then we'll divide energy by 2 now we'll see after this give the s print there is uh, so many matlab commands to write matlab codes in different ways s print f this statement we used in c language we can uh, as is from the language we can write the matlab code like this also next display the power is 0 else d equal to equal to 1 if the signal is periodic then energy of the signal is zero yeah. then power equal to power is divided by length of the sequence if length of the sequence is 4 then it will divided by 4 if length of the sequence is 2 then it will divide by 2 then give s print f once again Give the semicolon over there. Next, end the program. Give the semicolon after S can F. Otherwise, it will show error. Save the program. Energy. Dot M. Now run the code. Check in. command window some errors is there energy equal to norm of y which is a wrong statement here save it then run the program showing once again error fuck see the error carefully the variable energy is also the name of this script okay we can't while saving the program we have to change it that's it we gave the number same name so change the name go for save as give energy kin dot m now run it let's see ah it's coming 
Give the sequence is one, two, three, four. The signal is periodic. Energy is zero. This is what the equation we will give. Once again, we have to run the program to check the other output. Run the give input sequences. Give two as the input. Now power is zero because it is the periodic sequence. Let's check for the different conditions. It will execute the code. This is a small problem for finding out the energy and power of the given discrete signal or sequence. 